Justin is going to circulate the mic. Yes, my name is Neil Franklin. I'm wondering if what we're doing to curtail the uh, digital digital currency that the president is authorized through, I think it's executive order 14067 that has the potential for totally disrupting our lives and destroying the wealth that we've accumulated. Yeah, that's going to happen over my dead body. I will fight that at every turn. Um, So here's why. Um, look, if we adopt a central bank digital currency, it'll be the end, not only of sound money, what's left of sound money. It'll be the end of the Fourth Amendment. It'll be the end of the Fifth Amendment. They'll be able to use your currency, your financial transactions, to track everything you do and with it to regulate your life. If you want to live in China, you move to China. If you want to uh, live uh, like the Chinese people have to live, uh, you have to acknowledge that that's what you want, because that's what this would do. It's a terrible idea. It's why I've introduced legislation, uh, the first of its kind in the Senate, called the No CBDC Act, No Central Bank Digital Currency Act. Yeah. The No CBDC Act, should it pass, would stop it altogether. Now, they don't have the power to do this by executive action on their own. They believe they do. They want the Federal Reserve to carry forward uh, this concept and the Federal Reserve to put it in place. The Federal Reserve... According to many accounts, it's doing pilot program testing on what they could do. I don't believe they have the power, but out of an abundance of caution, I've introduced that bill.